now at 10, a, sun, a superstar country legend playing inside one of the most iconic and intimate venues in Texas. Garth Brooks normally fills huge arenas like the AT&T Center, but just minutes ago, he finished performing for free to fewer than 1,000 fans inside Green Hall. You're looking there live. Eyewitness News reporter Vanessa Croy explains how fans came from all over the country to see the dive bar tour. Well, she's my lady, look, hey, I'm a wild car man. Folks have been here most of the day, lining up in the blazing Texas sun. We are so excited. I drove from San Antonio, got here as fast as I could. Yeah. To see one of the biggest country superstars at the oldest dance hall in Texas. Yeah, yeah. And the only way to get inside, <laughs> win a ticket through a radio contest. And I put, I won't stand outside the fire, and I won't miss the dance, but I'll be with my friends in low places at Green Hall. And I got a message that I won. And for those who weren't lucky enough to get a coveted ticket inside Green Hall, they can watch from outside. And fans came from all over. It's a true honor to be here, especially all the way from upstate New York. But for one fan, every Garth show is special. I got his guitar. Rocky Lira and his dad travel around the state to see the superstar country singer they hold close to their hearts. Oh, 20 years ago, we were in uh, Bryan College Station. He did a concert. For a little act of kindness that meant the world to this cowboy. And he turned around and uh, signed the guitar that he was playing with. and. Turned around and handed it to him. Great guy. Vanessa joins us live outside Green Hall. Vanessa, Garth Brooks has been averaging 75,000 people in his stadium tours this year. Why is he playing at such a small venue here? Well, Deb, it's, Garth is in green tonight as part of his dive bar tour, where he's doing that to promote his new song with Blake Shelton. Now, this is just the third dive bar in the stop of seven across the country in the next few months. And we've learned that about 500 tickets were actually given away to see the concert here in Green Hall. But let me tell you, this area behind me was packed with people. They had a jumbotron out here so everybody else could enjoy the show. And a few people did stop me tonight to make sure we understood that Green Hall is not a dive bar. But as you can see, everybody out here enjoyed the show tonight. Deb? Yes, we can see that, Vanessa. Thank you.